If it gets any harder, we'll roast. We should have tried to cross the river at dawn, rat. You would have been caught out on the open water in daylight. That means death. <laughs> Silence, Vol! No! You take my life before you take hers. We'll all be dead if she gives away our hiding place with that racket. Then leave her to me. Your mob had better be ready as soon as the sun sets. They will be. Bollywoggled. That's what we are, old lad. Flummicated and flippin' bollywoggled. Bollywoggled. Belly hobbled. What? Wow! Ah! Someone's had their jelly wobbled. Don't cower so low. I'm friend, not foe. Uh, uh, good morning. I am called Matthias, warrior of Redwall. Sir Harry the Muse is the name that I use. That's funny. Why are you called the Muse? Why, pray, do you suppose? I'm master of poetry and prose. No equal have I in field or wood. No creature a smidgen, a fraction as good. So if you need a poet to choose, I suggest the owl, Sir Harry the Muse. <laughs> Bravo! Bravo, sir. Well said. <laughs> Well said indeed. Unfortunately, we are not looking for a poet at the moment, Sir Harry. We're looking for someone who can get us up there. Oh. We're following a nasty fox, a slaver, who has our friends and family as captives. Hmm. I might be able to help. Cake. Do you have any cake? Hey, you didn't talk in rhyme then. Why not? Because this is business. Verse is for conversation and pleasantry. Business is a business. <gasps> Straight speaking. Business for goodness sake. Perhaps we can find some cake. Maybe my friend will bring to you a shrew cake baked by a shrew. <laughs> not bad, not bad at all. At least it made me smile. For a warrior, I'd say quite good. You have a certain style. Wait here, sir. I will be back in a short while, and then we'll talk business. Right, troops, here's the drill. I want to see how many archers and sling throwers we can raise. Sling throwers he can raise. Now, 
When I give the command, fire away at the bell tower. But mind, keep an eye on those missiles. What goes up must come down. Oh, what come down? Redwall Defense Volunteers. Ready? Oh, this is so good. <laughs> oh, this is good. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so, so good. I can see this is going to be a very long practice. Now this, I have to see. Let's take a closer look. <laughs> Do they dare even to attempt to threaten us? Our next attack will be a pleasure. <laughs> Our party is spread far apart in the darkness of night, but I found Logalog, and he's prepared a fine shrew cake for you, sir. Excellent. Hmm. Hmm. Perhaps now you could help us find Slegar and our little ones. Of course. I watched the fox and his band taking a slave line up to the top there yesterday. They were here yesterday? How on earth did they get up there? There are rope ladders on the top. They pulled them up so you couldn't follow. Now, stand aside. Now, for only the 15th time, Redwall Defense Volunteers, ready? Aim! Fire! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> they are not trained in the ways of the warrior. True, Iron Beak. They cannot hope to defeat us like this. Let them waste their energy. When they tire, we will strike. Kill if you must. But I want hostages. Then they will see it is no use trying to defy General Ironbeak. Be careful on the plateau. There's danger there. Your journey ahead is perilous. Good fortune go with you. Ready. Aim. Fire! <laughs> now you don't good and heavy across downstairs. Ruder, you can sprinkle a plenty stone dust over the top. Here, slap her on, Gaffer. We won't have to listen to him crows after this. That's right, Long Dog. Now, if him's all ready, give him the signal. Our army. Quickly, you lot, before they catch on to our plan. Oh! Get that roof trap door open quickly! We'll fly inside to the upper gallery and beat them to the stairs! Beat what chairs, Chief? Oh, I said, beat them to the stairs, Ant Brain. Now get that trap door open! Bunch 
Hello, Gracie Peak. How would you like a taste of more grease? Here she goes. They don't know a diversionary tactic when they see one. Some warriors. <laughs> It's clear. We move on. The rats will join us by darkness. Matty, I'm scared that this is the last sunset we'll all see. I promise it's not, Tess. I'll get us out of here sooner than you think. I have news from the slaves that may interest you. <laughs> I've told Slagar about your foolish plan to escape. <laughs> he says we'll be meeting Stoneflex right soon, and you lot won't stand a chance. <laughs> Ooh, scared, are we? for mention and dispatches for that, what? It's not over yet, Basil. We've not got Cheek back yet, and we don't speak these hooligans' language. She's right, you know. We're caught in a blue and old standoff. The moment we let this chap go, we'll have the whole silly tribe down on our heads. Log along. You can go that way. Just tie the grass around these like that. See if you can make them understand we want to trade their leader for Cheek. Leave the rest to me. I've got an idea. Close together. They're definitely up to something. Look at them. They're terrified of fire. Stay close to Logalog and don't let the torches go out. Don't turn your backs on them. Cornflower, I do wish you'd tell me what you think you and I can do alone to defeat those wretched crows. Or the others will hear us. Mind that tripwire by your left paw. <laughs> the crows will still be cleaning themselves up. They'll not be expecting another attack so soon. <laughs> With the roof covered in grease, the pesky birds won't be able to spot on our roof anymore. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. When I say, pour both buckets at the same time. Ready. Boom! <gasps> ah! ah! Baby Rolo, what are you doing? Surprise! Ah! Wah, yeah. wah. Yeah. Get them! Ah! Quick! <gasps> <gasps> 
Excellent. Hostages. Ah! Grab claw. Fly down and tell them in the Abbey I want a meeting. Now we've got the upper talon. How much further, Stonefleck? Be patient. The rats meet us here. This is it. They'll be here soon. Shh. Get ready. I think I hear the rats coming. My comrades are here. Now! Get them! Chase them! Seize them! We're out of the woods. You've saved us, Matty. We've a long way to go before we're out of trouble. But it's a start. <laughs> <gasps> well, me arties, what have we here? And what might the likes of you horrible lot be doing out this time of the night? Leave us alone and we'll cause you no trouble. Cut em up, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Drop your knives, you sniveling scum. Those are the very creatures you came to ferry across the water. Stoneflank. It is you. <laughs> Out of the stewing pot and into the fire. Good morning. Do you wish to come inside? Ah! What I have to say can be said out here, earth crawlers. I hold the upper claw now, so we meet on my terms. Then speak. What do you want of us? Complete surrender, old mouse. I'm sorry, but that is impossible. Nothing is impossible if you hold dear the lives of your creatures. <gasps> oh, dear, no! I told you they'd try to escape. They'll try it again. They could just jump overboard and swim if they wanted. Impossible. These waters are home to a vicious breed of flesh-nibbling fish. They wouldn't survive a minute. It's a long way down, isn't it? If you don't hit the sides or bounce off a few gutters. <laughs> Imagine all that happening to a baby mouse. Then, as far as I'm concerned, you have our surrender. <laughs> but not completely. I am only the voice of one, and the Abbey belongs to us all. We must have time to consider your offer, and then a vote is to be taken. I will have your complete surrender now! I am sorry, but it is not my decision. Throw the captives from the roof if you must. You will only lose the upper talon, for then we'll have nothing to lose. We need time to take a ballot. How much time? Oh, at least three sunsets. That is too long. Two sunsets, not three. You will have two sunsets. Thank you, Iron Beak. You shall have our answer in two sunsets from now. Dash it! We've missed the blighters! What are we going to do now? No time to waste. Leave this to me. Rafting is my specialty. Now, Orlando, can you cut me down a nice, tall, straight tree? Mm. Plug, bring those ropes over here. Gern, soak that moss and mix it with soil. I want a good cocking that won't leak. The rest of you, gather the biggest driftwood logs you can find. Ratbane, look! They're on our tail! Fear not. I have more fighters at my command than leads on the trees, Fox. She's a stout raft, Logalog. I couldn't ask for better. What are you so worried about, Cheek? It's, uh, well, um, do you see? Well, it's the water. I've always been a bit frightened of it. Just look at the size of that river. <laughs> well, I've heard everything now. <laughs> a bally otter who's frightened of rivers <laughs> will curl my whiskers. That's a good one. <laughs> now, now, Basil, you're not too fond of the water yourself. 
Ha! Yes, point taken, Jess. Here, young Otto, my lad, what say you and I stay together in the middle of the raft? Stand ready. Take aim. Fire! Every beast overboard! <laughs> Let's watch and enjoy the sport. Oh, ambushed! Where in the name of fur and claw did that look? Oh, I've been bitten! Come off the raft! You'll be shot! We've got them. <laughs> They're heading right for us. Those that aren't eaten by the fish will be shot. <laughs> <laughs>